A few months ago, I reviewed the 72mm Aeon. I really loved these skates. But the Royales were very difficult for me. After a month of skating, I decided to swap the shells for some 60mm Aeons. This was a pretty easy process and cost around a hundred bucks. I set them up with some 58mm Concher flat wheels and took them to my local skate park to see how they perform. All right, these Aeons are great. They're how I remember them from that first roll, that, that flat lean, almost like a K2, where you kind of feel like you're falling backwards a little bit, but I feel as though I'm faster on a lean back. I don't know if it's just mental, but a lean back skate for me is, is the way to go. I forgot what it was like to skate flat. It's, you know, I've been skating anti rocker for a long time, you know, probably what, six months or so. And um, I forgot how fast it could be, how fun it could be up transitions. Um, it really, you know, it feels solid. Um, I always loved anti rocker because when you land, it's a straight line. Uh, because that wheelbase, the one to four, is so long, you know, it's 250 mil or so. Um, with these, it's shorter because you've got four wheel down, so you've actually got, you know, all the wheels touching. Um, but maybe the mix of the Conjure flat wheels um, is contributing to that, because they feel great. Um, you know, doing 360s felt great. Um, nice and landed, didn't feel squirrely when I, I landed the spin. Um, yeah, it's really good. All right, moment we've been waiting for. Let's try some grinds. <laughs> a little sticky. Well, that was very weird. Um, you know, locking soles Soul Tricks was fine. Uh, it took a little bit to start sliding them though. Like um, that first Mizu just kind of stuck. Um, and I know this ledge pretty well, you know, maybe it got destroyed the last time that I've been here, but I was here last week. I don't know. I don't know if it's a new soul thing or the ledge, but um, regardless, the locking was fine. I felt good getting on. Um, once I was on, I felt solid, you know, was able to do alley-oop tricks, no problem. Um, true Mizu, no problem. Felt, felt good, felt solid. All right, here comes, here comes some Royales. Well, I mean, they're better than 72s. Um, I definitely don't feel as confident on my Royale as I did on like my Seba or uh, the Volo, but they felt okay. Uh, front side was a little more difficult than back side. I think again, it's because of that, just like this shift, um, they have that big sole and I can really lean back on that sole. The, the front of the skate doesn't have that much um, material to lean on. Um, so when I get on Royale, I definitely, uh, I don't know, I felt like I was kind of slipping off. I also uh, bit a couple times on the wheels. I know that if I skated faster, um, I wouldn't have that problem, but you know, I'm used to skating with juice blocks on 50-50 uh, balance frames and you know, didn't need to skate faster. You could just jump on and slide anything, front foot, back foot. Um, backside felt good though. Um, felt really good. I feel like these skates, you know, the shortcomings that I found in the 72s, um, I mean, a 60 is, it's a really great setup. 
All right, I'm gonna rest up a little bit and then uh, try some top sides. Those smell pretty good. Um, I don't think I've ever landed a, uh, a kind grind that solid before. I, I, I mean, I'm just learning them, so for me that's, you know, not saying much, but um, yeah, I mean, I learned them in New Jacks, and that's a really tight boot. This has a little bit more wiggle, um, but once I locked on, I was able to just roll off and really get flat on that kind grind. It felt great. Uh, that top acid, I mean, it's like three tries and I was able to get on, so I'm really feeling these skates. I think they're um, they're going to be hard to uh, hard to pass up. After skating them for another month, I can honestly say that the USD Aeon is my favorite skate. They are extremely solid when skating, and the 60 millimeter frame gives you enough space to do Royale tricks with no issues. I highly recommend the 60mm Aeon for any aggressive skater.